Uh, today we're going to look at building the new Solaris Dome Kit. Um, this is the new super simple one. We're going to use mostly 2x2 uh, two two on this one. Um, it normally takes about a couple of weeks to make a dome. Um, and so there's a fair bit of work in it. Uh, we've designed this one to be as absolutely as simple as possible. There's uh, fewer parts, I think there's only two parts to make in the whole dome. Um, and we're looking at, we maybe can get this one done in a couple of days. So what I thought I'd do is I'd run through the build process in real time. We'll do time checks uh, to find out exactly how long it takes. So this is the first time I've built one, so it might take, a little, take me a little bit longer than it would normally. I've already made the pattern. I'll show you that in a minute. Um, so we've got one pattern. There is another additional pattern to add on to it that I haven't made yet because I need some of the parts cut. Um, I'm keeping it, I'll keep a time um, and we'll see exactly how long it takes to make it. Uh, what you'll need is roughly 15 lengths. That's 4.8 metres. Uh, I'm not sure what that is in feet. 16 foot, I think. Um, you need 15 lengths of 2 by 2 that's what we're going to start cutting and processing today. Um, what I'll do is I'll cut them up um, and machine them so they're ready to build. So we can we can put down a time for cutting and machining. I'll show you the pattern now. Right, this is our pattern. Uh, as you can see, it's diamond shaped. Um, I'll show you the dome that we're building on on the plan. I've got my little uh, prototype plans here. That's this kind of shape that we're building. Uh, you can see that there is, uh, it looks like triangles, but they're not. They're actually diamonds with a split down the middle. So each, each, uh, we're making this diamond shape in a wanna. And then we're going to make this base shape as well. So that's your two different shapes. And once we've made them, we should be, you know, pretty much done the door, finished the door. Um, We've got on our cutting list, I've just done a cutting list, that's the cutting list I've done, I'll give you a quick look at that. That's, I'm in metric at the minute, but you can easily convert them over. Um, you'll need, uh, med we call that medium long, Some, uh, I think it's only ten of those, uh, five of those because we're cutting them in half. Five of those, and this shorter length here, you need about forty-five of those. You'll need a solid piece of 2x2 two two to go across the centre and uh, a solid bit of 2x2 two two to go across the bottom. Uh, I'll process that lot now and I'll, we'll, we'll do some stop um, stop frame animation and that and we'll see how quick we can do, get it done. Okay, we've done the machining. Um, I've got my uh, lengths of wood cut with the angle on. They've got an angle on one end. So there's a bunch of those. Uh, I've put them in different piles. There's a pile there. There's a pile down here because there's two different ones in a in a diamond, uh, and these are our, are our central. I've just cut these, these are the central ones, they've got a point on the end. Right, we'll start um, to put a few together now. This is how they go together. That'll slide up to there, pop a screw in, and we'll work our way around. We're in stop frame motion now, so I'll show you, speed it up a bit. Okay, we have our diamond frames mostly together there. Um, I've got this one on here. 
which I'm going to be slightly different because the, normally we split them across this way but uh, for the door on this one we need to split split down the centre this way so I'll, I'll cut a piece of wood for that and do that in a minute um, at the moment <coughs> we're on about three hours um, so far on this build uh, now what I've done next is I've added on to the bottom of this diamond shaped pattern this half pattern at the bottom I've just screwed it on here uh, and what it does is it squares off the base so that we can get our side let's have a look at the plants here there you go it just this is actually a diamond shape but what the pattern does it squares off the bottom so that we can uh, make the base um, it's taken me half an hour to make that uh, and I've cut some more of these they're there for the base cut them for the base so we've got our long lengths medium long short at the top and the solid at the bottom uh, I'm going to put one together and see what it looks like Okay, that's the frame finished. Uh, them's the diamonds, and these are the base sections there. I've made eight base sections because I'm putting a big old door on this one, and it takes up two door sections. Um, so that's all the frame made. Uh, it's taken about five hours. I did have to make a bit of patterns and that, but we're roughly on about five hours there now. Um, I'll give the dogs a walk, and then I might look at covering it tonight. We're losing the light now. Um, I'll mark this out and I'll I'll see if I can get these covered indoors. I'm just laying the plastic out there now. Okay, I covered that last night. Uh, it took me four hours to cover them frames. See if I can get in. It's not too dark in here. Uh, that's the frame there, covered. And uh, we've got eight side panels and nine and a half of the diamond type shapes that's them there uh, over the next day or two I'm going to look at installing but we're, we're on a total of nine hours now for the build to this point um, and then I'll, in the next couple of days it's horrible out there now um, I'll get it built and we'll time how long it takes to build, build and complete the whole project